22 veterans commit suicide every day in this country. Today, a group marched from Richmond to Winchester, exactly 22 miles, to bring awareness and raise money to help veterans battling suicidal thoughts. Daniel Miskell was at the finish line waiting for them. Call time, 0600 hours for a group of 18 people who are not just people, they're a mix of active duty, reserves, and retired soldiers, as well as civilians who believe in doing something to stop veterans from losing hope. When we started this, it was it was literally just me and Ben um, and, and Bill just, just chilling and, and talking about things. And suicide is a, is a terrible issue and it often hits close to home and we, we, we knew we had to do something about it. We didn't know what that something was and that's, that's what this became. That was seven years ago. Now these soldiers have a tradition every Memorial Day to march 22 miles, a mile for every veteran who's no longer with them. It's a heartbreaking feeling that some in the march can relate to. I struggle with suicide. I know a lot of people who have. Um, just in the last year alone, I've lost two fellow service members to suicide, both in the Kentucky Guard um, and in the Minnesota Guard, which is where I used to serve. Um, so I'm thinking about them today while I do this. I'm thinking about myself, and I'm thinking about a lot of the people who are still here who have survived suicide um, because they, they won that battle that they had. The march took over 10 hours to complete. That includes the few times they had to stop to give their blistered feet a break and to hydrate. April Ambergie's husband drove in the march and she got a phone call that more water was needed. So she rushed over with a pack of water bottles. You know, we should not have veterans, 22 veterans a day that commit suicide. There should be something better, better help, better support. Um, I think our VA needs to step it up. Um, they need to do a better job of what they're because they're not doing a good enough job if we have 22 veterans a day to kill themselves. At VFW Post 2728 in Winchester, many waited in anticipation for the group and cheered them on in the final stretch. Uh, all proceeds go to veteran services organizations. We don't keep a dime. We, we, we give to the Veterans Crisis Line. We give to the Veterans Club of Kentucky who builds homes and takes care of physical issues. So we're trying to attack this from all sides. Memorial Day is known to many as a fun holiday. Before this group, it has a different perspective. Freedom comes at a cost. And if there's a way to stop losing more soldiers, this is what that march hopes to achieve. In Winchester, Danielle Miskell, Fox 56 News.